okay, we are recording. Um, we're not, um, we'll probably talk to Delphi a little bit later, but um, what's going on this week? We have a missing person out in Navarre. You're, That's, um, where, I grew up. That's where I spent a lot of time on that beach. And uh, I don't know, this is, this is creepy. Her name is Cassie Carley. Cassie Carley. 37. Yeah, um, she's friends with some of my friends from high school. I know that. It's giving me Tiffany Daniels vibes. I know, I keep thinking that, because the other end of the beach is where Tiffany Daniels got taken, and they found her car in her purse, and they could they never found Tiffany. And we've been meaning to do a deep dive in that case, too. Yeah, if you guys want us to do a deep dive into this um, Cassie Carly, it would be so easy for us, because we're right by Navarre. Yeah, you I, know. I spent so much time on that beach. I know, I probably know the spot she went missing from. Probably. Well, if she went missing from Juana's, if they're talking about Juana's, Juana's is a newer thing. I'm sure this lady went to school with my brother in uh, Navarre. Because uh, when I went to Navarre, there was no high school. Now there is. When I lived in Navarre. Okay, I just caught like a quick story. So the she was exchanging custody. She has a three-year-old. And she was exchanging custody with the father of the child. Yeah. And he's turned up with the child in Birmingham, but no Cassie. Birmingham, Alabama. Paint me a Birmingham. Birmingham. <laughs> That's a good song. But anyways, song. Um, Cox truck it out of my way. We're driving to. But uh, I, and, and my first thought was if I was going to uh, kidnap somebody or do something uh, malicious to anybody, that that is the last spot I would want to choose. That, that portion of that beach because of, well, me being raised there, I knew everybody and I can't yeah. go out there without seeing somebody I know. And there's cameras all over that parking lot, which I don't understand why they, they don't have no camera footage of it because there's cameras all over that parking lot. They I might, but they're doing a whole Delphi. They're keeping everything close to the vest, they say. Yeah, and, and I understand that. And the FBI's involved too. Yeah, well, that's, what, that's another strange thing when I first heard about it and first heard it was at Juana's because Juana's has a lot of cameras. Cause there's only one is is a hang. It started out as a little tiki hut. You went on the beach, had your little little dive bar. No, no dive bar, a tiki hut bar. Oh, like tiki you, hut bar. Like if you went to the Caribbean or Jamaica, would you oh. think you would be sitting at, you know, a little tiki hut? You know? Yeah. And you could sit there and you see now because I ate there one time when I worked at the Chamber of Commerce. But you sit down and look out at the water and it's beautiful blue, and um, mm -hmm. have a few drinks. You know, have you a steak. You know, the, the drinks with the umbrellas in it. You know, it's a, it's a touristy thing, but it's also a local thing. Because when I was there, it really wasn't that big. It was just a little tiny tiki hut, and it's grown so bigger. So, the ambience is, like, just like a gathering spot for Navarians. And tourists. And tourists. It's kind of both. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of both. And it's but if you think about Jamaica, beach, tiki hut, getting your little, little sippy drinky on. Um, Pina colada. Yeah, Margarita. pina colada whatever cosmopolitan <laughs> I mean everybody's gonna drive stupid today but yeah so uh, the reason I bring that point up is because that is a heavy, a very heavy locale thing for where everybody hangs out that's why they have a lot of a lot of cameras because they have a lot of problems in the parking lot at night and there's so much overflow oh. parking is on the side of the road and it's hard to find a parking spot so like, it was gravel yeah, I'm not too familiar with Navarre. Now, Pensacola Beach, I'm very familiar, but Navarre, I'm not so familiar. Well, that's what but I'm that's saying. your stomping I'm making, ground, I'm making, so... That's why I'm saying that, you know, it, it, it's kind of weird because they have cameras out there, and there's usually a lot of people out there. But Tuesday night is usually, like, kind of, well, me growing up there when there was nothing, it was dead. There wouldn't would have been nothing out there, so maybe it would be a spot. I don't know, but I still wouldn't want to Well, do all it. I can say is, like, they're... They took it serious from the jump because apparently her purse is still in the car. And, you know, even the police that did the press conference was like, my wife ain't going nowhere without her purse, yeah, you know? You can't, but the, that's my that's my whole issue. You can't be doing nothing in the car without it being known. Here's the issue, too. When you come back over the bridge, mm -hmm. in the main part of the store, because you got to go over the bridge to get to the bay, right. to get onto the island to get to Noir Beach. When you come back over or you're getting on and coming off, the what, one thing you see when you come up is these big glass windows from the Waffle House. Oh. <laughs> and they're look you can look straight on and see everybody coming on, on and off the beach. So if it's night and you grab somebody and there's not many cars out, they're going to recognize your car. 
Right. So maybe they should get the cameras from the uh, from the Waffle House to see you come on out, out off the beach. That bingo! The, the, there's Burger King right there too. Oh, it's got cameras. Well, I'm pretty sure. Like we don't know what all's come out. I know that I heard talk of there was there's two separate places being treated as a crime scene possibly. Yes. Um, I don't know what all they found. If they found anything on the beach or if they found something in her car. Well, it, this that's a new lead I just thought about. I didn't think about that. that the, the, the Waffle House and the Burger King cameras. There's two main yeah. stomping. And there's, a, and there's a new park they built right there on the bridge too. And I don't know if they, they have cameras that are watching that one too. I mean, they did because I, I know some people used to vandalize the bathrooms over there at the little on the base oh, side thing. People. So there may be cameras all around, and, we, that, and that's the problem. What was that one case? It was in Jacksonville or Tallahassee. It was a professor or something where they caught the person because they found the, the cams from the bus, from the city bus, and they found the oh. person's car that they rented, and they rented a car. I thought they could get away Way with it. Wait with it. There's cameras everywhere, y'all. You, you know that case? I can't remember I, what it was. It was a professor or something. I'll have to go back and look it up. I'll say it was some big name professor, and the wife hired a hitman, and the only reason they got him is they 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 got the city bus cams from the they had live cams on the city buses. Wow. And they caught the person in the car driving by the city bus at the time frame to show that they were there at the right time and everything. You can't get away with anything nowadays. That's what I'm on. There's so many cameras. We didn't get this out here. Everybody needs to check the Waffle House cameras to see you coming on and off that bridge within that time frame. Right. Because you might, and I'm not 100% sure, but it should, because it, it's like what, I, I, I can't explain it. I, I, well, we're going to cut this short for right now, but we'll we'll do another video like yeah. once we familiarize ourselves with more of the details. Video of the Waffle House over there. I know. Them. Wouldn't that be pretty? Well, I mean, not that there's a missing I'm person, sure, I'm but just it's... showing, you know, how well you can see across into that, coming on and off that bridge right. from sitting inside the oh. Waffle House. Okay, You are scaring me. I know. All right. Let's get off of here. I'll talk to y'all later.